Hey everyone, welcome back to our channel where we dive into the most captivating ideas and books from around the world. In today's video, we're exploring the key insights from Jeffrey Gittimer's The Little Red Book of Selling, 12.5 Principles of Sales Greatness. If you're looking to level up your sales game and build stronger relationships with your customers, this is a video for you. Let's dive in. Principle 1. Attitude is everything. Your attitude can make or break a sale. Positivity, confidence, and enthusiasm are infectious, so make sure you're radiating good vibes when approaching potential customers. Remember, people are more likely to buy from someone they like. Principle 2. The power of personal branding. Establish yourself as an expert in your field by sharing valuable content and insights. Building your personal brand not only positions you as a thought leader, but also attracts prospects who trust your expertise. Principle 3. Building trust is essential. People buy from those they trust. Be honest, transparent, and show genuine interest in your customers. This will help you establish long-lasting relationships and turn them into loyal customers who keep coming back for more. Principle 4. Create value for your customers. Focus on identifying and understanding your customers' needs and pain points. Then, present your product or service as the solution that will address their concerns and make their lives easier. Principle 5. Master the art of storytelling. People love stories. Use anecdotes, examples, and testimonials to illustrate the benefits of your product or service. By telling compelling stories, you'll keep your audience engaged and make your sales pitch more relatable and memorable. Principle 6. Ask powerful questions. Asking the right questions will help you uncover your customers' true needs and desires. Be genuinely curious and listen carefully to their answers. The more you understand about their situation, the better you'll be able to tailor your solution to fit their needs. Principle 7. Handling objections like a pro. Objections are a natural part of the sales process, so don't be afraid of them. Instead, see them as opportunities to address concerns and reinforce the value of your offering. Be prepared with well-thought-out responses and stay calm and composed during tough conversations. Principle 8. Embrace the power of networking. Building a strong network of contacts is invaluable in the world of sales. Attend industry events, join online forums, and engage with people on social media to expand your reach and create new opportunities. Principle 9. Be persistent and resilient. Sales can be a tough game, so it's crucial to stay motivated and keep going, even when things don't go as planned. Learn from your setbacks and use them to grow and improve. Principle 10. Follow up and follow through. The fortune is in the follow-up. Many sales are lost due to lack of follow-up or poor communication. Stay in touch with your prospects, provide additional information, and address any concerns they might have. Principle 11. Be a resource for your customers. Become the go-to person for your customers by providing valuable information, guidance, and support. By being a helpful resource, you'll create a strong bond with your customers and increase the likelihood of them returning for future purchases. Principle 12. Develop a winning sales strategy. Having a clear and well-defined sales strategy is essential for long-term success. Set specific goals, create a plan to achieve them, and continuously evaluate your progress. Adapt and refine your approach as needed to stay on track. And finally, Principle 12.5, have fun. Sales can be challenging, but it should also be enjoyable. Maintain a sense of humor and keep things lighthearted when possible. When you're having fun, It'll show in your interactions with customers and make the sales process more enjoyable for everyone involved. There you have it. Those were the 12.5 principles of sales greatness from Jeffrey Gittimer's The Little Red Book of Selling. Implement these principles in your sales strategy and you'll be well on your way to achieving success in the world of sales. Remember, it's all about building genuine connections with your customers and providing real value. Thank you so much for joining us today. And as always, Keep learning, stay curious, and until next time, happy reading.